breaking news alert. Yeah, and the breaking news is that we learned that five people were on that plane that crashed just in West Nashville. The FAA, NTSB on scene, and they will figure out what happened here. The crash site is on the side of I-40, right near Charlotte Pike. Peyton Kennedy is live near the scene now with what we know so far. Exactly. A total of five people have died in this crash. That is all of the occupants on board, according to the Metro Nashville Police Department. So what happened so far is we know that around 740 p.m. air traffic control at the John C. Toon Airport received a message from the pilot that they were experiencing engine and power failure and needed emergency approval to land. They were given that approval, but then the pilot reportedly said they weren't going to make it to the runway. Cameras captured the moment the single engine plane came down behind the Costco store off of Charlotte Pike and next to the eastbound lanes of I-40. I looked and um, the trees were down and um, all of a sudden there was, there was a flame and then all of a sudden a big fire and then it erupted into a ball of flame and then um, it exploded and I watched, uh, just watched it, and um, I stayed back from it, and I was trying to tell people to stay away from it because it was very, very dangerous. And you just heard from a witness I spoke to this morning who experienced the whole thing. Officials say when the plane hit the ground, it immediately went up in flames. Police say in the process, no vehicles or buildings were hit and no people on the ground were injured. The FAA is here investigating the circumstances along with the National Transportation and Safety Board. Now, part of that investigation is determining where this plane came from. I'm told they could not find a tail number in the wreckage. This investigation will be ongoing, of course, and we'll keep you posted here on News 2. Live in Nashville, Peyton Kennedy, News 2.